Is it possible for one person to wrap a brand new C8 Corvette without taking anything apart? Today, we're gonna find out. Of course, this episode is brought to you by ParadoxStyling.com. Go there to get all the hottest colors in the game and wrap your car today. Finally, we got almost all the cars back in the yard. We got the Audi chilling over there, the Spider, the VR4. The S13 is finally back after months and months of being gone. We got the S14, we got the Fairlane, and of course, you guys are here for this video, we got the C8. The only car that I'm missing is the red MR2. That is getting work done right now. It's leaking some coolant or something like that, and it should be back probably in the next couple of weeks or so. So hopefully by then we'll have all the cars back in the yard and we can do a new video with all the cars and we can just have them all lined up and looking good. But first, we can't have the C8 looking stock. So that's why you guys are here. That's right. We're going to be wrapping the C8 today. Ooh, look at the girls. Look at the girls all parked. That's right. And over here. Oh, I have missed this one so much. She's got that aggressive wing. I love it. Let me know what color I should do this one next. Here we go. The C8, the object of this video. Ooh, she looking good. If you go on the Paradox Wraps page, you can see this color and a whole bunch of other colors in 4K video. This is gonna be a sick color. If you want this, you know where to get it. Go to paradoxstyling.com. I will link the link to this color in the description below. So I'm gonna be wrapping this whole C8 Corvette without having to take anything off, including that wing back there, the little spoiler. Um, we're not taking the side scoops off or anything like that. We're not taking the splitter kit off. In fact, I'm gonna make it a point to wrap this whole thing with that splitter kit on the car. So it's gonna look great. The bumper doesn't need to come off. Everything stays, including the mirror. So if you just bought a new C8 and you and your kid or your son or your dad want to collab and wrap this car you don't have to worry about disassembling it and then trying to figure out how to reassemble it and voiding your warranty or breaking anything because i'm going to show you how to wrap this whole thing without removing anything mm -mm -mm. let's go it's time to party
What's up guys? It's super early in the morning and the car is all done and looking so good. All right, we're about to pull up right now. I see a Friero and maybe like an old uh, 280Z or something like that. We gonna follow them. They know where they're going. Oh, this is nice. Look at all these folks. Look at Mark with his right hand drive. Little bus thing. <laughs> look at him, look at him. Like a roller coaster. Yeah, right. <laughs> this is it right here. That's all you got. Roller coaster, baby. This is all you got from Honda. Hey, does it fall down? Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, no, no, I was thinking it's like, it's like one of those things in the oh, roller coaster, right? I, don't, I know they make a table that goes right here. Oh, that would be good. Oh, it's they couple. should. It's really they rare. Should, huh? Like but the, the I like the yellow there. bar better. Yeah, they're usually the Honda basket, but I didn't get it on this one. So no third row seat. And they come they come on a four wheel drive too. Yeah. yeah. Then they have a double glass window. Oh look at them. Look at them. What, are they, what are these BBS? Overlander. Yeah, we'll catch up with the dude. Alright, Mark's gonna react to the car. What do you think of the new color? I, I love it. I think it looks amazing. I love the blue color. Oh that's <laughs> that's the wrong Corvette. No, it looks good. What do you think about this color? I like it. It looks good. Yeah. Very, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah got yeah. the chameleon look thing going on and you know it's different. Is it does it look purple to you? It looks kind of pink it's to like, me. Okay. It's like a um, you know it's funny, I had a white S13 that was uh it was a white base with a pink clear uh -huh. on it, like a like a light tint they put on it. Yeah, yeah. It's almost like that, but it looks like they put there's a lot more uh pinkish like slightly light purple but it looks good because it looks actually so like from far away it looks silver and then the, the like you know the outline of the fender uh -huh. that looks pink Yeah. But with the black I don't think it I think it depends on the lighting of the day yeah, like the day. Uh, if there's a lot of sunlight out it's more pinkish but if there's less sunlight and it's like more yeah. gloomy then it's kind of purple no, it looks good you can see it with the red interior too with the little side axis and everything it makes it pop a lot more it's crazy how they change the whole position too I should have glittered it huh no the, <laughs> no the glitter's cool but just sometimes it looks so dull yeah. like on certain Areas you gotta really like have the sun really hit it. But this looks good at any time of day. I put some bronze wheels on it, some T37. Oh, T's or something. Uh huh. Those would look sick on there. They make t do, do they make T37s in 20s? Uh, I'm pretty sure they make them in 20s and 21s. What's your lug pattern though? Did they change it on the vet? What are they like? What is it? Uh, I have no idea. Five by I'm sure it's like regular vet lug patterns. Five by something or whatever. They probably should. They, they probably should. Yeah, yeah, but 21s and TEs. 21, yeah. Pretty sure you can get 21s and right, TEs. Right. Let us know, guys. Yeah, yeah. What wheels for the Corvette? Yo, okay. For real, this color looks even better when there's low light. So you don't get as much glare off of the uh, the gloss on camera. So during low light or like in the evening time or under led this thing looks crazy bro damn yo this is it right here <laughs> looks so good shoot all right i'm gonna insert this clip so you guys can kind of see what this looks like in the evening time damn wild all right, 
Here we go, gas station shots. Damn. That gray to purple transition is so good. Holy cow. Sheesh. <laughs> Look at that. That's looking super exotic, yo. Dang. All right, guys, there it is. The car finally all done. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> so as you saw in the video, I do have to do this section in here in a whole separate, um, a whole separate piece for it to stay. If you try to push it into there, it's never going to go. And so you run a seam along this edge right here all the way around. Okay. And then the rest of the stuff is pretty much all one piece. Um, there's not much to it than that. As you've already seen, I've shown you this in low light, in gas station light, and in bright sunlight. Oh my goodness. Look at the way that hits. All right, we'll, we'll give it to you in cinematic mode as well. Some people like this mode, some don't. But I think it gives the video more depth. Let me know what you think. All right, back on the GoPro. The front bumper was pretty hard. The only thing you really need to do without taking anything apart is to just loosen these three bolts right here. So there's three bolts down here. One, two, three. Kind of hard to get it from the back, but if you're patient, you can do it through these vents. You don't have to take anything apart. And that will loosen this thing. I mean, technically this whole unit pops out, but I don't want to mess with those clips. So I just pop out the clip that's right here. It's, it's not even a clip. It's like a, a little plastic like extension thing that keeps this in place. Once that's off, you can work around behind it. And all I do, of course, is just to cut off right here. And then you can just work the whole thing up. Um, if you really want to, you can put some color under here. But who's crawling under your car? To look at this if they uh can see it that means your car is too high or they're just haters <laughs> all right there you go and on the door of course i also cheated and i didn't take this mirror off so when you don't take the mirror off you do run a little seam right here but i think it's definitely worth it especially if you're like me and you get nervous messing with like brand new cars you don't break any clips because you're not a professional dismantler, neither am I. So that's the benefit of uh, wrapping a whole car without taking anything apart. Right here, I mean, you could probably figure out how to take these things apart. It's probably like videos how to. So if you can, that would be a whole lot easier, a whole lot cleaner. But um, if you just want to do it like me and just take the shortcut, you can just run a seam right here. Okay, you can't even see that seam, right? <laughs> yeah barely and then it kind of just goes up right here so like you saw in the video you do this portion this portion first and then you do that one to overlap it and unless you know it's there you will never see it because there's that body line there mm -mm. she's looking so good i really like the vet without any badges on it because i personally think it looks more exotic yo look at this shift though dang Son, wild. <laughs> All right, guys, there you have it. The Candy Magenta Gray, brand new color. Never been on the website before, so I'm going to put the pictures of this vet onto the website, and you can order that color from the website. The link will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. Like always, subscribe, leave me a comment, and I'll catch you guys later.